Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to General Hospital Latest News. Jack Brennan flirts with Carly in the upcoming General Hospital episode on October 9, 2024, but potential threats could make her next move more difficult. Jack Brennan, Charles Majeure, escalates his flirtation with Carly Spencer, Laura Wright, in the next General Hospital episode, which airs on October 9, 2024. He invites her to dinner in the hopes that their evening would develop into something more. However, given her complicated relationships and the mounting threat in the background, Carly's choice could have deadly repercussions. Carly is the object of Jack Brennan's more than casual interest, as he expresses a desire to continue their connection after dinner. However, if Felicia Scorpios, Christina Wagner, warnings come to pass, things could get far more problematic. Felicia is already worried of being followed, and she believes the private investigator may be targeting Carly because of Martin Gray's Michael E. Knight, connection. Holly Sutton, Emma Sams, who has her own secrets, including stolen diamonds that could get her into trouble, may also be mentioned in Felicia's warning. This impending storm may include Holly's encounter with Sonny Corinthos, Maurice Bernard, at Pozzolos. However, Sonny is enmeshed in a romantic conflict with Natalia Ramirez, Eva LaRue, which has many questioning his true feelings. In another scene, Jason Morgan, Steve Burton and Anna Devane, Fanola Hughes, have a clumsy meeting after their unexpected kiss. There are indications that their feelings are more profound, but they both minimize it, attributing it to a flash of intense passion. There is discussion about whether Jason will be with Anna or someone else in the impending love scene that is hinted at by the excitement surrounding him. Along with the romantic relationships, there is mayhem at Bobby's restaurant while Dex Heller, Evan Hofer, and another police officer look into vandalism that Lucky Spencer, Jonathan Jackson, perpetrated. Overwhelmed by his failure to assist Lou Spencer, Alexa Havens, Lucky vents his rage on the eatery while attempting to hide it. Lucky is contemplating leaving Port Charles due to his personal problems, but his mother Laura Collins, Jeannie Francis, may intervene in time to persuade him to stay. While romance, secrets, and investigations rage around Port Charles, Carly's choices could put her in jeopardy as the drama on General Hospital plays out. Will Felicia's warning sign indicate a greater threat ahead, or will she yield to Brennan's advances? As these narratives progress, viewers may anticipate a lot of twists and suspense because there are so many persons involved in emotional and personal struggles. For many years, Scott Baldwin's character Ken Schreiner from General Hospital has appeared in soap operas. Ken has undoubtedly encountered his fair share of vanishing characters who reappeared as quickly as they vanished. Schreiner, however, lately talked about the treatment of long-term character. Schreiner talks about his most recent soap opera scenes as well. General Hospital Spoilers Scott Baldwin has been absent for a while since 1977. Schreiner has played Scott intermittently. Scott appeared on screen for a considerable amount of time before leaving to return later. Additionally, Scott appeared as a character on the General Hospital spin-off Port Charles. Prior to its cancellation, a number of other General Hospital characters also made appearances on Port Charles. When he assisted the pharmacist who tampered with Sonny Corinthos, Maurice Bernard, bipolar medication and hiding from Sonny, Scott was last seen in August. It goes without saying that Scott was collaborating with his ex-son-in-law Jagger Cates, played by Adam J. Harrington who intended to arrest the pharmacist and shield him from Sonny. When Scott tried to transfer the pharmacist to Windermere, he got into a fight with Jason. Scott, however, fled and hasn't been seen since. Following his final visit, Schreiner announced on social media that Scott was no longer there. The sooner Scott returns, the better, said another commenter. How long till Scott comes back? I held the actors who were there and kept the show on the air for 14 years in the highest esteem when I came on at General Hospital in 1977, Baldwin wrote on September 30. Although times have changed, the long-running characters are now treated with no respect. Fans discussed scenes from years ago on Shriner's post-hand. Additionally, Scott shared a picture of his on-screen parents, Susan Brown and Peter Hansen two of the numerous actors who enabled me to have a 47-year run-on at General Hospital and seven other soap operas, Schreiner also posted on X. It's time to complete the other things I neglected to do in an effort to keep Scotty current. Well, Scotty had lived his last two lines about Blaze Donuts, so if that's the end of at General Hospital, I did it my way like Sinatra, Schreiner wrote later. 
I'll tell you what, I'll get us some glazed donuts and coffee. So sit tight, I'll be back. Schreiner was alluding to his final two comments on the show. He didn't mean to return for the pharmacist, of course. This gossip is over. If you like the video, then give your opinion in the comment box and stay with us by subscribing the channel. Thank you.